Hi guys, hello and welcome to Inceptor Gaming. If you're new to my channel, click like and give me a subscribe and put down in the comments about the sort of RTS, simulation, RPG or any other sort of games you like to play. Today I'm continuing with Cold Waters, not played it in a long time but I thought I'd pick it up again. This is part 16, Soviet Strike Group. Okay, so here we are then. Uh, as you see we're somewhere near the Japanese sea and we've got to track down the uh, a Soviet strike group that is basically backing up the People's Republic of China and already we can hear we've got sonar active Rig ship for ultra quiet. contacts going on out there so somebody is using so active sonar already come right to zero four one helm I now luckily I am using the quietest sub in the game so I doubt they've detected me as yet but it's always possible you never know So I'm just going to turn towards the bearing, reduce speed to two knots Make to improve my uh, my Make sonar detection four, capability. Two knots, maneuvering eye. Okay, we are in very, very, very shallow water, which I try not to fight in as if possible. Uh, but today, clearly, that is not going to be an option. On the plus side, there is a lot of foliage on the bottom of the ocean there. That can help mask us quite a lot. Come right to zero three three helm I. So I think I'm going to uh, hug the bottom of the ocean basically and try and lose myself in the vegetation there, and that should help mask my signature somewhat. Con maneuvering, making turns for two knots. Yeah, there's at least two or three, I'd say possibly three, active sonar pings going on out there already. Although the one thing with sonar is it does pick anything up within range of it. However, active sonar does have a very, very short range. So my passive sonar there has already picked up one contact. Uh, we'll have to classify what that is. Okay, so straight away, first Sierra contact is a U block. Classified as escort. That is a very, a very capable uh, guided destroyer. I'm going to have to watch myself around that beast. Con sonar, new contact bearing zero two seven designated Sierra two. Okay, second contacts. Just having a quick check as well, uh, see if it's a submarine. Sometimes the Soviets do deploy a submarine with their strike groups as well, just to uh, help screen the units and counter detect any uh, submarines out there. But looking at the uh, classification on the panel there, I'm thinking this is possibly a fleet oiler, which is more than likely Con the case. Sonar. Sierra 2 is classified as merchant. Yep, that's a fleet oiler. Okay, so I've one Udloy, one fleet oiler so far. It is also looking like this is most likely the uh, strike group I'm searching for, though, because usually any large carrier groups or strike groups have a fleet uh, oiler alongside with them. Still haven't picked up the other contacts yet though, that's a little bit concerning. Because uh, Soviet groups also often use uh, Passing 100 feet. ASW helicopters or have cover with ASW aircraft as well as some description. Just going to drop down now to the sea floor, uh, hold the bottom basically so as I get closer to the enemy units there should hopefully be less chance of them picking me up. Let's get nice and close. Con, less than 50 feet below the keel. Passing 200 feet. Yeah, I want to get down to around about 10 feet, roughly thereabouts. Uh, 
Okay, it's got good fire solution on the Udloy. Alright, 74% solution on the uh, fleet's oil at this time. So I need that to improve a little bit, although the oil is not as important. The most important vessel here for me is the uh, is the uh, carrier or the main ship in the group. Okay, I notice a slightly different tone in sonar there as well. Okay, look at the Yudloy there. It is in very close range to myself at the moment. I do believe though the fact I'm hugging the bottom like this uh, with all the uh, vegetation around is doing a good job of masking my uh, masking myself and my noise signature. Not that I give off much noise to be fair. But even though I haven't detected the, the other two units which are active for sonar as well, um, Getting this close to the escort means I'm probably going to be detected very Shoot soon. Two, three. So therefore Aye, I'm launching off my countermeasure already. My MOS uh, torpedo. Two, Aye, sir. So that when the action starts at least that should get picked up as being myself when it's not me. Okay so the Udloy head there has obviously counterfired a one, torpedo. Zero. Maneuvering Looks like it's fired at, at my decoy, which is good. Con, fire control, what con, sonar. And because I'm so close, I've already con, got. Uh, maneuvering, making turns for. I've already one, got target zero. acquisition with my torpedo Make on it. Turns for one, five, not. Oh, I've just lost. I. It has just dropped a counter measure, which is con, uh, not going to do much help for, really. One, five, not. My torpedo is wire guided. I push speed up now to 15 knots as well, just to create a bit of distance between myself and also my own decoy. Because last thing I want to do is course. for their torpedo to go for the Con, decoy, miss the decoy bearing. when they can't hit it, Zero, and then go searching nine, for me. Con, sonar, lost contact. Sierra, one, last bearing. Zero, come right to. Zero, four, three, helm, I. Okay, so far so good. Udloy is down. I don't appear to be detected. Two, two, one. Aye, sir. The torpedo they launched as well was too close two, to, uh, two, two. to arm Aye, itself, sir. so it's just going off into the... Uh, into the wilderness there, not going to find me, which is good. Con, helm, steady course. Rig ship for ultra quiet. Passing 200 feet. And I've also just launched Con, our torpedo room, tube three ready. One torpedo there for the direction of the oiler, and another torpedo in the direction of the active sonar, although I don't have a fix on that position. Although I believe Sierra 3 though could actually Con be what I'm looking for. Sierra 3 is classified as capital ship. Okay, Sierra 3 capital ship, Kiev class cruiser. Right, that is what I want. So that is the most important vessel I can take down in this level. I've got another decoy loaded as well, which I'm going to use to fire Shoot, in the opposite two, direction. Three. Aye, sir. Because look at this, the enemy are using sonar boys, so there's at least one aircraft in the air now searching Con, for me. Fire control, weapon acquired. Okay, Sierra 3 is a lot closer than it appeared to be, which is good. So my torpedo there has already got acquisition on it, which is good. Come right to zero, nine, zero, helm I. Although one torpedo won't be enough to take it down, but at least it will do it some damage. Con sonar, noisemaker, bearing, zero, one, okay, seven. Torpedo's closing. Oh. There's a countermeasure though, so it's going around in circles. Just need to uh, bring it back on course there. Con, fire control, weapon acquired. Okay, and I'm also actually, as my other torpedo, which is Con, close to control, the oiler, uh, is also close to the carrier, I'm going to turn that back towards the carrier. Con, torpedo you can hear there, there's a plane going overhead ready. now, so I'm definitely being searched for. There we 
Tokyo. Carrier is definitely damaged. Oh, Kiev yeah, cruise, I should say. It's not, it's not officially a, a carrier, although it kind of is. Sonar, noise maker bearing zero. There we three, go. The is gone. Excellent. And I've still not yet been detected, Con, which is very, very good indeed. So let's take down the oiler. I think I'm going to use a tomahawk on the oiler just because it's getting some distance between it and me now. Don't really want to uh, drag this out any longer than necessary. Oh, look at that. Okay. Just about Shoot enough distance eight. between Aye, myself sir. and the. Uh, and the oiler for the cruise missile, which is good. So that's the way. Con sonar lost contact. Sierra two last bearing zero four five contact breaking up. Okay, oiler is gone. Okay, so that's three of definitely four targets down. I'm noticing there is another active sonar ping, so I'm going to have to fire another torpedo down the bearing of the remaining active ping there. Shoot two five, aye sir. Con torpedo room two two ready. Although I'm actually going to have to adjust the position of that torpedo, otherwise it's just going to hit the side of the ULO, which is already gone. <laughs> Don't waste the torpedo on an already dead target. Passing 200 feet. Come left to zero three six helm I. Okay, that remaining Uloy has got to be quite close. I think it probably is a Uloy. Fire control, weapon acquired. Okay, target acquired, so it is close. Con sonar, noise maker, bearing, one, two, it's three. It's very close, actually, because there's the cannon Come as well. Come left, okay. two, zero, six, one, helm, I. Ah, okay, room, okay. So the torpedo there has actually uh, has found um, has found my decoy. <laughs> so main torpedo is going after my decoy, but definitely close in the close vicinity is the my intended target. So I'm going to steer that back on target. That's one good thing as well. Uh, whenever an enemy drops a countermeasure, that is definitely where the enemy is at that moment in time. The countermeasure is so noisy that is an exact position and its last location. Now my torpedo is having difficulty finding it and it's going to go back for the decoy. Now it needs to manually steer it onto the uh, correct target. Con sonar, noise maker, bearing, con, helm, steady course. Sonar, noise maker, bearing, one, two, three. Ah, there it is. Okay, target has been found. Con, torpedo room, two, three, ready. Torpedo closing in. Con, sonar, new contact, bearing, two, Aircraft nine, still overhead seven, there somewhere. Designated Sierra, four. And boom, goodbye to you, right then. Now it is just a case then of getting out of dodge because there, there is at least one um, sonar boy in, in the in the sea there near me, so I'm gonna have to get away from that so the aircraft doesn't pick me up. I see there's a new new contact as well, which hasn't been uh, classified as yet. But looking at the uh, 
of classifications there. I believe that probably is just an innocent merchant, so that's nothing to worry about. I just need to concern myself really with the aircraft uh, flying overhead periodically. Okay, yeah, that is an instant merchant, so I can disregard that as a target. Just double checking, but yeah, I think, yeah, it is a merchant, yeah, definitely. So, Con sonar, that. Sierra 4 is classified as merchant. So all targets appear to be down, it is just now me getting out of dodge. And there is weapons Main in the area as well, so obviously I can't one, just uh, zero, not uh, leave the mission at this point, which is a shame. Con maneuvering, making turns for one zero knots. So my plan here then, I'm going to steer my ship basically up the middle of those two destroyed con, contacts. Con, there. Good time compression as well. I'll do that. That should give me a much better chance of escape because the noise coming off those con, two uh, signals contacts. Tube eight ready. Uh, some grounds in the bulkheads the coming from the ships that are down. That should mask my signature. Just push speed up 10 knots as well does help. 10 knots is a good uh, evasion speed when you're just trying to sneak out of somewhere as well. It's not too fast, but it's not too it's not too quiet either. Because if obviously if you're going too fast, you'll make so much noise you'll get picked up. Sierra, four, I'm last slightly bearing, too close two, to the bottom two, now, I'm just going to have to adjust, uh, adjust my ballast. Increase that in a minute. Even though this game is about three years old now, I uh, still like the way the details on the vessels do look. They do look pretty good. Although it is pretty funny, I still find it funny. Looking at the top of the deck of the uh, ship, there you can see the aircraft Con is still perfectly Sarah, in place. <laughs> the aircraft four, never never one, moves, never gets seven, blown over two. the side or whatever. That's, that's always kind of funny when I see that. And you know, it's like the aircraft is fixed with super glue or something. <laughs> Don't know, not to worry. Still quite a fun, enjoyable game at the end of the day. Okay, there we go, so I can now exit the mission, fantastic. Oh, that's weird. So it's telling me I sunk one Udeloy and didn't detect one. Well, I sunk two Udeloys, I sunk the Kiev and I sunk the Euler. So, <laughs> to me, I sunk four of four ships, but according to that, there was one I didn't, didn't detect. That's got to be a glitch. Anyway, so, but that is a successful mission. And there's the obligatory news report confirming that is a job well done, basically. So thank you very much indeed for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this content. I hope you enjoyed my videos and my channel in general. Please give me a like, give me a subscribe and put it in the comments so, um, if you play this game at all or any other sort of games you like to play or maybe anything you'd like to see me play on my own channel. Thank you indeed.